Hi everyone, welcome back to YouTube channel. So in this informative video, we address the common issue of being blocked from assigning due to a multiple unsuccessful attempt. With the incorrect account or password, we understand the frustration this can cause, but we are not. We provide you with practical solution and a step by step guidance on what to do and face this situation. By following our expert advice, you will be able to regain access to your account safely and securely. So don't let sign in issue hold your back any longer. Watch this video now and lock the secret of your resolving this problem. So let's start this tutorial. So here the also you have to wait for account and block. In some cases the lockout may expire after a certain period of time, usually around some time. In such cases you will need to wait before attempting to sign in again. So these are the first solution and now talking about the second solution to change your recovery password. So first you have to sign in page and going and then click on the forget password link then enter your email address or a username associated with the account so for the instruction in the email you receive to reset your password so to recover your password click here and follow the instruction so these are the link to recover your password so we will provide in the description box so you can easily go through this page move to solution third to signing using another microsoft account to sign in using another microsoft account reach out and here account setting and choose sign in with Microsoft account instead. So enter the credential for the correct Microsoft account and sign it. So you have to restart your computer to complete the sign in process and during the computer setup process, ensure to set up your correct Microsoft account. So now move to solution. Contact Microsoft support. If this is the last result. You have to reach their contact support team because you have to try all of the stuff but not resolve the problem. So they are the last result. I will provide you in a description box this link of their contact support team. You can find also this link in our previous video. After signing to your Microsoft account for the skill section to connect with the live support exam. So these are some simple solutions you have to do when you tackle the problem of your don't signing in your after attempt too many times in your Microsoft account. So thank you for watching the video. I hope you like it and we will catch you in our next video with further information. Thank you.